Hey guys, Team FTL here, bringing you guys a Spike Brothers deck profile. Now, Spike Brothers is a very rush deck, so you need to rush a lot. If you don't, if you can't rush, you basically lose, and yeah, it's win hard, lose hard. So yeah, the starter for uh, Spike Brothers is Mecha Trainer. I run him because the other starter just sucks. He's basically a Skydiver at grade 0, which is pretty bad. So yeah, and uh, Mecha Trainer can search out for any grade 1, which is good for rushing, so a pretty good card. Next, we got four crit triggers. Now, these crit triggers allow you to soul charge them to unflip damage. That's an okay skill, I guess, if you're desperate and going for game. Next, we got another four crit triggers. These are just 5k. Four draw triggers. And four heal triggers. Now, stand triggers are really bad in Spike Brothers. Some of you may argue that um, stands allow you to stand the boosters, but still, that doesn't make a really big difference. I mean, they're still pretty bad. I'd rather just have a crit trigger and do two damage instead. Okay, next for grade ones, we have four Wonder Boys. They're basically AK Manelas, the um, boosters basically. Not bad, pretty good actually. We got four medical managers. Basically, medical managers um, allow you to soul charge your card from the top of your deck, which is a pretty good card. I mean, like it allows you to use um, skills such as Reckless Express skill, um, Bracky, High Speed Bracky, and uh, Dragon Mount Maximum. It's a pretty good card. Also, a 7k booster. Next, we got four Reckless Express. Now these cards tag out like Bracky, High Speed Brackies, and Dragonite Maximum. They attack for they swing for 12, and if you boost it with a Wonder Boy, they swing for 20, which is a magic number on a 20k van, uh, 10k Vanguard. So it's a pretty good card actually. It forces a 15k guard. Next we got two Cheer Girl Marylands. Basically these are perfect guards, as you can see. Um, they're okay I guess. I used to run three, but then. Three was a little much, and then you couldn't rush it. Rush is good, so then um I decided to run two instead, and two's been working out pretty good. Cause then when you're at five damage, it's really good for guarding. Next we got a Dudley Daisy. Now I used to run a Dudley Dan. Then Dudley Dan wasn't that good of a card, but then cause you have to replace it with a Wonder Boy afterwards, so that was kind of minus. So then I decided to run a Daisy instead. It's a seven K booster, and its effect is decent. Okay, next we got three hot treasured Black Panthers. They're basically 10k beaters. They're okay, I guess. They, um, you get intercept with them. Not bad. Okay, uh, um, next we got three Field Drillers. Now, Field Drillers are a pretty good card. Boosted by a Wonder Boy, they attack for 15 and forces the opponent to guard for 10 if they, um, want you to get that, don't want you to get the plus one. But still, even if you get a trigger, I mean, it, the attack goes through and they waste a the guard. So then you still get the plus one. It's pretty good, actually. So then, since Spike Brothers is a rush deck, these are, these cards are very important. Because, yeah, they give you that one card hand advantage and it's pretty useful. Okay, next we got four high speed brackies. These cards are so great. I mean, like, they're really good. Because then they attack for 14 by themselves. Like, if you use a skill. And they also can tag out, and it's also a good intercept if you're desperate, I guess. So not bad. Next we got four Juggernaut Maximums. Juggernauts are such a good card. Okay, they swing for 16 on their own, and uh, basically when you use the skill, they swing for 16, and it forces a 10k guard, which is really nice, because then you need your pressure opponent at um, early game. And these um these cards allow you to go for game basically, and yeah, not bad. Next we got four Dudley Emperors. Basically, um Dudley Emperors allow you allow you to call back two units from your deck. So the basic strategy of um Spike Brothers is to attack with two um Juggernaut Maximums using their Soul Blast, and then um, forcing the opponent to guard for 10. 10 each, so that's 20k guard. Then, you use um, Dudley Emperor's effect to Soul Charge two cards and call them back out. Now you have two, um, three, um, two boosters to like uh, attack for really high damage, and it forces lots of guard. I think it forces like 70k guard if your opponent's at 5 damage. 
So yeah, Dolly Emperors are a really good card. You need to run four of these. Okay, yep. Yeah. That's the deck profile. Thanks, guys.